Hello children. How are you all? Welcome to class 3. Today we are going to learn mathematics which we use in our day to day life. In class 2 children we have learned about 2 digit and 3 digit numbers. Today in class 3 we will learn about 4 digit numbers with the help of abacus and chart. Let us now start with the chapter numbers. Four digit numbers. As we have learned two digit and three digit number in class two, the smallest two digit number is 10, the largest two digit number is 99 and three, the smallest three digit number is 100 the largest three digit number is 999 now let us know about four digit number when you add one to the largest three digit number that is 999 we get a four digit number we read this as 1000 in words we write it as 1000. 1000 is the smallest four digit number. Four digit numbers. It stands in the fourth place in the place value chart. The largest four digit number is 9999. We write 9 in the place of 1's, 9 in the place of 10's, 9 in the place of 100 and 9 in the place of 1000. 4 digit number on an abacus. Let us read about 4 digit numbers with the help of abacus. Count the number of bits in this fives that shows ones, tens, hundreds and thousands respectively. We have five bits in the ones column, two bits in the tens column, three bits in the hundred column and four bits in the thousand columns. The same numerals may be written in the place value chart like this 4325. Now let us try some examples. Let us arrange this four digit number in the place value chart and write their number names. 8987 We write 7 in the 1's place 8 in the 10's place 9 in the 100th place and 8 in the 1000's place So we have 8,900 8 10's and 7 1's We write it as 8987 now let us write the numerals for the given number name 1987 we have 1900 8 tens and 7 ones we write it as 1900 and 87 next 7566 we have 7500 six tens and six ones we write it as 7566 
now next we will read the abacus and write the numerals and the number names in this abacus we have six bits in the ones place three bits in the tens place two bits in the hundred place and five bits in the thousands place we write this as 5, 2, 3, 6. We write this in words 5236. Now, next is phase value of a digit in a numeral. The phase value of a digit in a numeral will remain the same at whatever place it stands. There will be no change in the value thus in 9876 the phase value of 6 is 6 the phase value of 7 is 7 the phase value of 8 is only 8 and the phase value of 9 is only 9 now we have place value of a digit in a numeral the place value of a digit in a numeral depends upon the position in the place value chart. Let us see an example by using a four digit number. First, let us arrange 6879 in the place value chart. The place value of 9 will be 9 once which is equal to 9. The place value of 7 will be 7 tenths which equals to 70. The place value of 8 will be 800 which is equals to 800 and the place value of 6 will be 6000 which is equal to 6000 numerals in expanded form a numeral when expressed as a sum of the place value of its digits is said to be its expanded form let us see this with an example first of all place the number 9876 in the place value chart 9876 9876 is equal to 9000 plus 800 plus 7 tens plus 6 ones which is equal to 9000 plus 800 plus 70 plus 6 this is called the expanded form of the number 9876 now let's see successor of a number successor of a number the successor the number that comes just after a particular number is called its successor the numerical order the successor of a number is one more than the number the successor of five is 5 plus 1 that is 6 the successor of 25 is 25 plus 1 that is 26 the successor of 125 is 125 plus 1 that is 126 next we have 
predecessor of a number. The number that comes just before a particular number is called its predecessor. The predecessor of 5 is is 5 minus 1 that is 4. The predecessor of 25 is 25 minus 1 that is 24. The predecessor of 125 is 125 minus 1 that is 124. Next we have is ordering of numbers. There are two types of ordering number namely ascending order and descending order. The numbers are arranged using the comparison rules. When given numbers are arranged from greatest to the smallest, it is called descending order. For example, 8000, 7000, 6,000, 5,000. When given numbers are arranged from smallest to the greatest, it is called ascending order. For example, 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 and 4 thousand thank you children here we end with chapter number one in next class we will continue with chapter number two addition without caring thank you bye and be safe